Hi, I'm Bill Myers and this is another one of my video tips of the week. In this week's video tip, I'm going to show you how to record streaming audio directly to your computer. Now this might be useful if you want to record a podcast or if you want to record audio from a video that's playing on the computer or audio from anywhere that's on the computer. It's pretty easy to do. We're going to do this using the free Audacity program. Now if you search the web, you'll find tutorials showing you how to do it with Audacity. Basically there are four steps, but it can be kind of complicated, so I'm going to show you the easy way. First thing you want to do is start Audacity, and this is what Audacity looks like. The first thing you have to do is set up Audacity so it will record from your computer. And the way we do that is with these three windows right through here, and these are called the recording device. The first one we want to choose is Windows WAS API, if that's available. If not, choose MME. On the second one, choose your speakers. Now, I've got Realtek Audio High Definition audio card in mind, so that's what I'm choosing. On the third one, which is things, it's the recording device. Again, we're going to choose the, your speakers from the recording device. Now, it's not really recording from the speakers. When you choose this right here, it says it's recording the digital feed that would be going to the speakers. And on this fourth one here, make sure that you choose stereo. Once you've got that, you want to come over here to edit and come down to preferences. And on preferences, click the recording link. And on the recording link, make sure that where it says software playthrough, that you have that unchecked. If you don't uncheck that, you're going to get a lot of feedback because it's going to try to record, record, record what it's actually recording. So it would be an infinite loop of recording. Once you do that, click OK. Next thing you want to do is come up here into this window right here. These are your levels. These are your playback levels. We're going to go over to the one on the right and we're going to right click on it. And we're going to make sure that disable meter is not checked. And we do want to click start monitoring. And when we click start monitoring, there shouldn't be anything there. Next, you want to go to the page where you want to record something from the web. Now, this can be from the web or any other source. We're going to go to my site where I've got a video file. And what we want to do is we want to play this video file. But before we do that, what we also want to do is to bring the window down so that we can see our recording level. What should happen is when we play this, there should be a recording level here telling us that the input is actually working. So we'll do that. Hi, I'm Bill Myers, and this is another one of my videos. And what that recording level was telling us was that the audio stream that's coming from this video is actually going into Audacity, and that's what we wanted it to do. So what we can do now is that we can go to Audacity, we can hit the record button, and that tells us to start recording, and then we go back to the page where we wanted to record from, hit the video. Hi, I'm Bill Myers, and this is another one of my And it's recording the audio from this video clip here, and it'll record it until we stop. And one way we can make sure that it's recording is we can see here that the tracks are recording loud. Now one of the things you may have wanted to do before you started was to adjust the volume so the re recording volume is not so loud. Now you would think to reduce the volume, you'd come up here to your microphone and reduce that volume. But that doesn't work because you're actually recording from the playback of the computer. I know it doesn't make sense, but you're recording directly from the playback of the computer. So to reduce your recording volume, you actually slide the playback volume down. This will adjust your playback volume. Now, it, generally, it's a good idea to adjust the playback volume before you start recording. Anyway, that's how you do it in Audacity. The steps are fairly easy. Again, what we did is we set our recording device to be Windows WASAP. We set the speakers to be for the computer. Uh, we set the microphone to be the speakers. We told it to do two stereo recordings. And over here in Edit under Preferences, we made sure we unchecked Software Playthrough. And then we clicked OK. And then we right clicked to start monitoring so we could see the audio levels and then we adjusted our playback volume and then we pressed the record button and then start the playing of the video or the podcast or whatever it is you want to record. Anyway, it's pretty easy to do. Once you do the three steps, if you get those correct, it'll record for you. But if you do have problems, you can go to the tutorial recording audio playing on the computer. Uh, the link is below this video. Thought you might be interested in knowing how to do this. I'm Bill Myers. This has been another one of my video tips of the week. You can find more like this at www.bmyers.com.